How did you hit me? I had a shield. Oh, I got him to hit himself. Ooh, no, 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 no. Just keep eating. Just keep eating. We're not gonna die to a skeleton. Like, I refuse to die to a skeleton. Not on day seven. Hey guys, it's Wolf of Valhalla Gaming, and we are back in Minecraft. And not just any Minecraft, we are in our hardcore world, which means if I die, it's done. And we are coming to the end of day... D -d 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 five. Day five? Yeah. So, that's where we left off last round was day five. It's coming to the end of it, so we're gonna just go to sleep and start the next day. I've been doing some designing in a different world for what I want to do with our little tunnel here. So first things first is I would like to expand it a little bit. And we're going to push it back another five, I think. Or not five, but it is a one, two, three currently, so it needs to be five. So we're going to push it back a little bit. Um, can probably get rid of this wood because it's in the way. Hello, Radar. Radar wants to be a part of the video so bad, but I just don't have my webcam, so he can't join us just yet. Let's see, this needs to go right here, I think. One, two, three. Yeah, that works, because it'll be two on that side. Unless I moved it over one, but I don't think that would look as good on the outside. So I know from the, um, the time lapse, this looks a little bit different. I did kind of change just a little bit of how it would look. Uh... I kind of wanted to build up this, like, dirt wall around it, kind of, if that makes sense. Um, just to give it that, like, buried-in, natural-looking texture. I know what I'm saying doesn't really make sense unless you can visualize it, but it'll all make sense once it's done. Yeah, we throw a little bit of that there, a little bit of that there. Kind of bury that in right there and add that, and then we have this nice little pathway right here. This river, I think I'm going to continue it and curve it this way, so it kind of curves. And I'm going to curve it around and then curve it back into the other side over here. But that's uh, for another day. Let's We can work on the house at night now, so I don't really want to do that. So honestly, today's goal is to get a safe area. We need a safe area outside to do foodstuffs with. So I need all of my cobblestone, and I have to remember how to make walls. There we go, walls. So we're going to make a lot of walls. So it, it takes six to make six? Cool. So can I just... Uh, where's walls? There we go. So we have 36 walls. That'll give us a small area. As you saw in my inventory, I also have a little bit of steel... Or steel. Iron. I got some iron when I was uh, moving the door to the side over there. So that'll be quite nice to use later on as well. But we've made it to day six without dying. Pretty sure. Let's just double check. Yeah, day six. I gotta remember where the days are. So we made it day six without dying, which is quite nice. Quite nice indeed. Um, you know, I'm kind of scared of this series because I know how I am. And if I die from something ridiculously dumb, uh, I'm probably going to quit the game for a long time. <laughs> You will never see another Minecraft episode if I die. Radar, hush. Okay, so we're gonna go over here. And we got some wood, we got our... I'm not sure what... I think I want the level of, like, where the village area and the rest of the compound to be. is gonna be, like, one higher, so it's actually gonna be level with that. So it's actually gonna come out, like, one right here. Yeah, I think I like that, just two above sea level. That's pretty good. We do have a pretty good source of food right here. We got fishies. But um, fishies are not the one-stop one shop for food, I suppose, is the best way to do it. So we're going to get some more cobblestone, if I have some. I should have some in that floating chest. It's a very loud vehicle outside the house. Unnecessary. Yeah, we got some more cobblestone. So we're going to bring this cobble out here. And then I also kind of want to bury this in a little bit more. But that's another project. Maybe a little bit of off-screen gameplay there. There we go. And there we go. We have 60 walls. 
We also need to probably get this glass, because I kind of want to do glass... What was that noise? Glass panes instead of glass uh, blocks. Uh, I guess so. Um, but we also need some stuff to put in there to burn. So, uh... Do I have coal? I think I have coal in there, too. So let's put that in there. Just get that, get that. Give me a dish. Put that in there, and how do I do that? Do I do it like that? I don't know how to do glass. Glass. Oh, okay. There we go. We have 16, which I think is enough for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. So we're halfway done, kind of, as long as I don't mess this up somehow. Perfect. We're halfway there with our glass. Let me go grab the coal so we can smelt that iron really quick. Do I have coal? I do not have coal, I have flint and steel. Can you use a magma block to smelt things? It would make sense. It's hot. I don't know. Can we? Can we put a magma block in here as fuel? No, we cannot. That's kind of stupid. But I've been working with some, like, module-style buildings, and I think that's what I'm going to go with here is a module-style. Um, it's going to be... So it'll be five blocks of spruce circle, and then we'll have a kind of like a cutoff section I guess is the best way to explain I don't know how to explain it it's better to just show y'all but I don't have my create well I have my creative world which is completely different from this world that I've been working on just like designing things in so I know what I'm doing because I really do want to make something that's you know I'm proud to live in because I'm going to be here for a couple minecraft days at least a hundred could do a, a year in minecraft I'd probably lose my mind though all right, so we do that, and then we keep going. So this will be, now it's one, two, three, four. So this is five. So we, we will have enough materials, ideally. But um, you do this, then you do that. And it's supposed to just kind of line up with that. And then I want to replace all this oak with spruce, honestly. So we're going to do that, too. We're going to replace that oak with spruce, and then we're probably going to move everything in one to the right. That way I can... Yeah, it'll look better if I center it, I think, instead of having this, like, gap over here. We'll leave this gap for now. Uh, throw a torch in it, just to light up the area. And then I forgot how to make lanterns, but I would like to make some lanterns, just because I feel like they're a bit more sturdy than torches, and they look better, and you can hang them, and... It's a bunch of aesthetics, but, you know, tomato, tomato. So once we get enough of this andesite, can you make andesite walls? What do they look like? Or maybe dorite walls instead of this cobblestone. Like, the cobblestone will be nice to start with because it's just abundant, but once we get going, I'd really like to do a different design, maybe. Squids keep killing themselves, which is perfect because now we have black ink, which means I can dye my bed black, right? Or I can just get black dye. And then dye the bed black, I think. How do you how do you dye a bed? Do I just mine purple? Okay, so I just take bed, then I put black. There we go. We have black bed. Instead of black beard, we are black bed. Perfect. Alright. So we're gonna come out here. Um we don't really have can you burn seeds? You can't burn seeds. You can burn saplings, I know that, but I don't really want to do that. Can you burn... Sugar cane? I don't know, because I really don't need the sugar cane just yet. So we can burn sugar cane, maybe. You cannot burn sugar cane. What can you burn? Charcoal, iron ingot. Oh, these are just things you can make. Okay. Okay, that makes sense. You can burn sticks, I know that. I don't really want to burn my sticks, though. Let's just start burning oak. We'll start burning the oak down. Let's make another axe here, because we're going to need it. 
cobblestone axe. There we go. Then we're going to make some walls here. Oh, you can make andesite walls. Okay, how do they look? Those don't look too bad, actually, compared to what do dorite walls look like? I'm pretty sure you can do dorite too, can't you? What does a dorite wall look like? I got 24 dorite. What do these look like? Dorite and a site. Can you do polished? I don't think I can polish it once I craft it into a wall, can I? Yeah. Okay, so you can do that, that, or our typical cobblestone wall, which we have the most cobblestone, so we'll probably do a cobblestone wall anyway. But that's just for now. We've got some iron. We've got some spruce. So we're finally going to make our first defensive item here, which is our shield, which is this, I believe. And then you take that out, and you put an iron there, and you get a shield, and then you go into your inventory, and you equip it, because we need something to protect us. And with that, we also have five, which is enough for... Ooh. I'd like a pickaxe, I would like an axe, but I'd also like armor. I think armor is my most valuable thing right now, just to keep me alive, because I'm a klutz, and I'm going to kill myself if I'm not careful. So we're going to go ahead and put some armor on as well. And we have one chunk of armor. But we're going to go to bed, because we're cowards. And that's going to be the end of day six. The beginning of every Minecraft series ever. You cut wood. That's it. That's all we do. We just chop the wood. Alright, but I can protect myself now, which is what matters. So we still have two iron. Um, that's not enough to do really anything with. So we're just going to kind of... I can make a hoe with it, I guess. But you can't make a housewife out of a hoe. And we're just going to cut all this down. That was a bad pun, I apologize. And we're just going to cut all this down. And we're going to work on maybe making our small farm. So unfortunately... We don't have three iron, which would be really nice, because you need three in order to uh, make a bucket, I think. What's a bucket? Bucket? Bucket! Bucket. Bucket. Yeah, we need three. So I need one more iron, which is a shame, because I just used it all to make my armor. Did not think ahead of that one, did I? So this is now five, at least, so we got that going for us, so we can finish this area. And kind of get some more supplies going. Should bring all my crafting stuff inside anyway. It's probably the smartest thing to do. So, we just... One, and two, and three, and one, and two. And there we go. And we get some more supplies out of that. And we come up here, and we do the same thing. Oh, there. I thought there was green up there for half a second. That scared me. Day seven, looking nice. So far so easy and i just jinxed myself because i'm an awful person yeah that's how we're gonna do this we're just gonna hope for the best because if i die on like day 98 i'm done i'm done i'm done i'm not that great at minecraft if we're being honest like i'm i've never been great at minecraft um but this is gonna be either a win or lose situation i guess and there's a reason that it says season one because i'm gonna try this until i get this challenge completed but i did find these sweet berries and apparently sweet berries are pretty good because they hurt things that go into them so i can eventually use these sweet berries as a uh, kind of a perimeter like once i build a wall i put sweet berries around it and then Anything that touches the sweet berries eventually kills themselves, right? Six, so I kind of want to do a seven by seven so I can get my farm going, and then I can just keep the rest as snacks. Pretty sure you can also turn them into red dye, maybe? I don't think, I don't know what else you can do with sweet berries. Other than maybe tame foxes. I think you can tame foxes with berries. Oh, look, some more black ink. These squids just keep killing themselves, which is nice. And yeah, so we're just going to chop down some more trees over here. And then eventually we'll replace the birch, but I need some iron again, so unfortunately we have to go mining. That's uh, not ideal at all. I do need iron so we can do the other stuff, and then also, do I have some more dirt? I don't really have some more dirt, but I would like to get the rest of this sand. So we're going to get the sand so I can get some more glass. We need at least six, I think. 
that was the halfway as we had like six in there so whatever we do with this we'll just throw it in there it'll smelt it is what it is that'll give us some more sand and then we're just going to keep cutting some trees down yeah there we go oh is there a cave over there that i didn't see before oh there we go because if there's a exposed there is an exposed cave over here is there iron in here if there's like a few chunks of iron that'd be quite nice I don't trust anything, but there is iron. Where are my torch? I I hear... Oh, no. No, 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 no. Our first encounter, and he's already got two shots on me. That's kind of cheaty. Where are you at? No. We're not going to die on day seven. Not to a skeleton. Ow. Ow. Go to hell, you. Ow! God, aimbot. There we go. How did you hit me? I had a shield. Oh, I got him to hit himself. Ooh, no, 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 no. Just keep eating. Just keep eating. We're not gonna die to a skeleton. Like, I refuse to die to a skeleton. Not on day seven. There we go. All that's down there now is a creeper. Um, are you going to blow up from right there? You are. Okay. I see you. This is the nope cave, apparently. Did somebody else shoot at me? Oh, I just want this iron. Can I please just get this iron? Give me some cobble. Let me just build a cap over this. So this is the cave of, uh, no. I don't want to go down there, but we're going to get this iron really quick. I can do that. I really was not expecting there to be two iron. I can deal with that. That's all I really need. Did that skeleton drop anything? I don't think so. I got arrows sticking out of my feet. It hurts to walk. It hurts to walk. Look at all the sheep up there, though. Doesn't that make you happy? So many sheepies. All right, so let's get this. We're going to throw some oak in here. Um, we need three of that, but we probably should work on smelting the iron first, honestly. Let's get the iron smelted. Uh, I'm going to eat again. I should probably not look down while I'm eating my berries. And then we need to start working. So a single thing of water can do, I think it's a five by five. I'm not sure. I'm going to make a hoe really quick and figure it out like the math behind it and i'm also going to fill this hole in because i hate having random holes because holes are how you die you fall in there and then a creeper falls on you and it's just a bad time it's a bad time nobody likes it nobody wins and then i lose my mind so we're going to fill this hole in there we go perfect put that there smelted our two iron smelt that let's make a bucket Bucket, 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 bucket. We got a bucket. We got water. Now, we need a hoe. Which means we do this. And we take our cobble and we do that. And we have a stone hoe. Okay. So now we're going to take this. We're going to come up here and we're going to build a field. Our first farm field for our compound village that we will one day build. Um, I would also like to cover in this because I don't want to fall down there in a fight one night. So we... Do I have any extra dirt? I really need something more filling than these stupid sweet berries. I need to build a farm. We need food. Food and sand. Okay, so we have enough glass. I know, my... I don't have ADHD, but uh, sometimes it feels like it because I just get distracted by everything. So let's just go ahead and one... Two, three, four, five, six, and it makes it really easy to not mess this up if I have something above it. So we'll just do it that way. And then we can do that, and then two, three, four, five, six, seven. So what? And that leaves us with three, so one, two, three. 
and we're almost done. We've got one, two, three, four, five. So another round of six, and we'll be good. So we just put some more oak in there. We'll be fine. All right. Let's eat some more sweet berries. Nom, 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 nom. We almost died on day seven. Cannot believe that. Ugh, I suck at this game. All right. So let's figure the whole math behind this out and where I want to put this farm. Actually, I think my sweet berries are right where I was going to plan on putting the farm. So we're going to grab some of the... Do I have any dirt in my inventory? Let's go check the chest, see if I have any dirt. Eat some of our sweet berries. Ugh. That iron was worth it. Do I have any more spruce? I do. But I didn't have a pickaxe. So we're going to finish this really quick too for the five. And then I'm going to build the next layer after this is going to be the... Uh, it's going to be the, why can't I English, the like design. So you'll see exactly what one module will look like once I'm done with this wall, kind of. Yeah, there we go. All that's left is that side. But once I'm done with this module, we'll see. Um, do I have any more dirt? No, I have granite. I wonder what granite walls would look like. Ooh, getting fancy. So fancy, fancy, fancy. Oh, I hit the wrong button. Let's not do that. Let's grab some more torches, too, while we're at it, because it's going to get dangerous out there. And did I accidentally put my stuff away? Uh, sword, you're going to be one. Pickaxe, going to be three. Torches, four. All right. Oh, it's starting to get dark. Can I go to bed yet? No. Okay. Well, then. To hell with you, too, game. To hell with you too. Where's my hoe? You're going to be way over here. So let's see. I don't have any dirt, so I kind of need to start digging up dirt because I want to bury this in, and this will just become the first field. So, Actually, I didn't even need... If I'm going to turn this into a field, I really didn't need the whole bucket, did I? That's a shame. Okay. Well, we've got dirt, so we can just kind of... Leave, like, one square of water, I guess, like right here, and then fill the rest of this in, and it'll become our... That's... Ooh, it's getting real dark really fast. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Do-do-do-do-do-do. Straight into house I go to sleep all night. The first few days, I'm going to be a coward, because I don't have armor. I don't have... Can you make... How do you make chainmail? I thought you could make chainmail at one point, or is that something you find? I don't remember. Can I make... That's not what I want. Armor. Cauldron. Chainmail? Well, you can make a chain, but you cannot make chainmail. Interesting. Okay. What, uh, chest plate. That's not what I wanted at all chest what if I do this oh okay all right well we're gonna get some more dirt and then start over here I'm gonna get that flower and we're gonna just keep working away we gotta build this farm eventually because I need food so we're gonna cut down all the trees around the farm and we're gonna build the first farm area and then we're gonna surround it with some sweet berries that way it kills anything that comes near it that's how we're gonna do this and I also don't want grass growing on it so I'm gonna outline it with probably some oak wood I think since oak is the most prevalent wood here we're gonna use it to outline things I don't know if we'll use it for much else I don't really need that bucket anymore but whatever one two three four five all right so we're gonna do this uh, I think it goes in like a four by four, like four away from this will be irrigated. So if I go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, jeez. Oh, that's why. So we're going to see how much of that gets irrigated. And then I'm going to work on filling in the rest of the water, I guess. And then we're going to start making our first farm and figure out the food issue while we deal with all these seeds, too. Actually, can't water just... Yeah, it can. 
Ooh, that almost went straight into my thorn berries. Sweet berries, thorn berries. Nigel Thornberry. There we go, there we go, there we go. Just kind of getting rid of all the grass and everything right here. Does not look like it's doing very well. Why are you... Can we just go in every direction, please, and thank you. Thank you. I guess not. Okay, well. I'll just do this by hand. Blah, 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 blah. There we go. All right. Um, one, two, three, four. So yeah, it is a four wide. So one, two, three, four. And then you just kind of connect them. If I remember how to do that properly. And we're just going to kind of work on making the rest of this an even area. Where's the dirt at? Should have just made a shovel. That probably would have made this whole digging thing easier. We're eventually going to take that whole cliff down. We're going to flatten this area out because the flatter it is, the easier it is to see things. And the easier it is to see things, the less I get snuck up on by creepy boys. The second I hear a creepy boy, I'm running. I ain't dealing with explosives. Especially not in my village. And this is going to be like our first bastion of safety, I guess. There we go. And then we can kind of just cover you up too. So this entire area should theoretically get irrigated. And then we do the same thing. So we go one, two, three, four. And then... Right? That's the right size, right? Pretty sure that's the right size. Yeah, that's the right size. I don't know why these are being weird about it, but I'm just going to put those back down. And then we go one, two, three, four. And you start irrigating from the outside, just like that. Uh huh. Very nice, very nice indeed. That is quite nice, quite nice. And from here, we just start putting our our cobblestone wall around. Oh, that's not where I, I need to put a fence gate right there. Cobblestone wall around it. That's not where that wall was supposed to go. Eventually, I'll build a second farm right next to this one, and that's where that will go. But for now, this is the first farm. And perfect. And now all I need is like a fence gate. I'm going to put a fence gate around it and then we'll have a food area. Uh, we have enough glass now for that. How do I make a fence? Eh, I need sticks, don't I? Fence gate. There we go. Uh, I guess it'll be spruce because I really don't care. We'll do spruce fence gate. And then we really need to get some seeds. But since we did the fence gate, now we have to do all of our oak over here. So we're going to dig up everything around it. That way we don't grow grass in there by accident. And this might take a second, but you know, it is what it is. Wow. Oh, there's the rest of the oak planks. I thought that was all of them already. I was about to be kind of upset. There we go. And by the nature of the way this is done, it's already like a perfect uneven square. It's got one block offset, so it's just perfect for the kind of building I do, because I don't like doing doubles, even numbers in Minecraft are the devil. There we go, there we go, there we go. Quite nice, quite nice indeed. And maybe it would have looked better with a normal fence, but I kind of like the fact that we just have a bunch of cobble. So we do this, and then just kind of finish putting all this down here. We do all of that, and people next door quite loud banging on everything like that it's quite rude 
Okay, and how much seed do we have? We've got 15 wheat seeds. That's not a whole lot, but it's also enough to start, I guess. And then we can take our torches, and you kind of just put them right here, and then you put one right here, and then you put one right here, and 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 then since it would offset it, you do one on each side of this, and then one right here, and then since I can do that, I didn't know you could do that. Interesting. Quite interesting. I didn't know you could place a fence in water and it not mess up with a water source. I was just expecting to have to go get a new water source. That is... Ow! 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 These damn bushes! They're gonna be the death of me. Oh god, that scared me. You bastard. Watch me eat your family in front of you. Ugh, you're supposed to protect me, not to kill me. I have to build a fence around these bushes, too. Ow! Stop it. I'm just gonna kill all of you. How much fence do I have? Do I have enough to build another frickin' farm around these things? Uh, let's build... Let's start building a road around it, I suppose. Let's get some glass made. Uh, da -da -da -da. That makes 16, which is quite nice indeed, because now we're gonna have some extra. One, two, three. There we go. And then... Two, two. And we cut you down like that and that. And we do that and that. And there we go. Now we have a nice seamless front window. It's quite lovely. Quite lovely indeed. We are definitely on day eight and I did not lose count. Eat some more berries really quick. Okay. I think that's all we needed to do right there. Uh, let's try and get some more seeds. And how much... We don't have enough of this for another farm, do we? Definitely don't have enough cobble for another farm right now. Or enough seeds, but that's fine. We'll get there. That's another... <gasps> Ooh, that's a big hole. Oh, no, 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 no. I refuse, I refuse, I refuse. Let's make a stone shovel. We have enough of this and that, and then you do that. Oh, nope, nope, nope. Then you do that, and then you kind of have one of these, and now you can make a pathway. And I have enough to make another one of those, so we're going to do this. We're going to go one. Kind of make, like, our initial area, I guess. There we go. And then we're gonna go over here and we're gonna see about how large of a prickleberry farm we're gonna have here. So what is it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I think it's an eleven. It's just one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11. So yeah, it is an 11. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And it's dark. Run away. I don't like the dark. I don't like the dark. I don't like the dark. We're just working on food right now. I don't want to fight things. I'm a fighter. or I'm a lover, not a fighter. Leave me alone. Need to get some undying totems and some more iron is what we really need. Um, is there anything? There are things burning, which means things did spawn, which means I have to be very aware of possible bad creepers and the likes of. I know I said I could work on the house at night, but I also don't want to spawn a phantom by accident. Okay, so we have 11. Oops, I did the 11 too far forward, so we're just gonna pretend that didn't happen. And we're gonna go back, and we are on day 9. Only 91 days left to... What am I doing to myself? I hate my life. 
I really don't want to do that. Uh, 91 more days in this game without dying. Normally, I wouldn't care, like, legitimately. But I just have to watch my back and know what I'm doing and be very, very aware of my surroundings. There's a spider up there. Um, they're non-aggroed at night, so that shouldn't be too much of an issue. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, it should just be ten by now. Yep, there we go. And then we go another ten this way. So one, two, five, six, seven. Fill in this hole. There we go. And the amount of terraforming I'm going to have to do here is a little ridiculous, but it is what it is. This is a very, like, hilly landscape, which is great. It's beautiful. I love that I'm building here, but at the same time, like, it's going to take some terraforming to get it up to par with what I would like. Alright, so let's get some more dirt, and we'll finish terraforming this area at least. Then we'll go plant some more seeds over there in our farm. There's plenty of animals here, too, which is going to be fantastic for whenever we decide to start our animal farm and start uh, animal husbandry, I guess, the proper terminology, but, you know, whatever we're doing. Pretty sure I'm going to have to dig that row up anyway, but, you know, it is what it is, because that row goes right here, which will end up connecting to this row. Cool. Yeah, so everything inside of here is going to be allowed to grow. have any more oak. I do not have oak. I have oak slabs. Not good enough. Okay. We'll chop down some more oak. Get rid of this. Put down another uh, however many of these walls I have, which is not going to be enough. Three, four, five. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, definitely not enough. We have a little bit of cobblestone, but I don't think that's enough to make walls. I think you actually we might have enough to make six, because I think it is six for six. So we'll have enough for six. It's not a whole lot, but it is what it is. Just grab the cobble. Then you do that, and you do that, and that's not what I needed at all. So we'll just make another row of these, and this is going to be our prickly farm. Once I get some more oak. Let's get some more oak. There we go. And then I suppose I can work on the house for day 10 because currently I would just like to get the rest of this done. But I need more cobblestone in order to finish this. So we do that. We do this. I'm going to go plant the rest of these wheat seeds I have. It looks quite nice. I'm actually quite... I like this design for a farm. That is quite nice. Okay. That is quite nice. That is done. That tree back there is disintegrating. Um, let's build an, oh, another spruce. Probably should have done it in oak, honestly, if we're being realistic here. Is this how you make a fence? It is. Okay. Oh, I don't have enough. Okay. Um, let's make another stick, I guess, then. And make another fence. And we're going to replace that spruce with oak. And I guess oak is going to become our outliner and spruce is going to become our normal thing. There we go. And we put another one over here, even though it's not quite... No! You bastard. Go down where you're supposed to. Day 9. Whew. 91 more days left to go, guys. We're gonna get some stuff done, but... Priorities. Current priorities is... Food. Because I'm sick of eating these prickly berries. They do the job, but they don't do it well. I need bread. Man's gotta eat. There's coal up there. I'm stupid. 
I could have been using coal the entire time here. Whatever. We're gonna come over here. I also need birch wood. Come in here, because I'm gonna replace all of this oak with birch. Two, I think I have six spruce on me. I don't know how much spruce. Yeah, I have exactly enough to do that. So this is gonna take a while to finish that area. Not too worried about it. I had sticks up here, I'm stupid. I also really want to do a spruce door, but I don't feel like wasting my spruce on that just yet. Um, I have enough cobble for another set of walls, but I just want to kind of get it done, so we're just going to do this. And I'm going to finish this first module off before this episode ends, and y'all can see how the module system is going to work. It's actually a very nice design. I've seen a similar design done before. Um, very similar. I think it works well if you're doing these like in the cave or like built into a rock wall style houses. It's just very easy. It's easy to repeat. It looks nice. It's symmetrical. It works. And if you know me, you know I am a sucker for symmetry. Even though I suck at math. But that's a debate for another day. Oh no, I should have left that there. Dang it. Whatever. We're going to figure that out later. All right, so now all I need is birch wood. But first things first, we're going to come over here, and we're going to do these. And we're going to run up here, and I think the birch trees are over here, so I'm going to chop a few of them down. Yeah, there's some birch trees. Okay, so we're going to run over to the birch trees, chop them down, not fall in these holes, these deadly, freaking nightmarish areas that exist for some reason. Are there some coal over there too that we can mine so we're gonna do that as well and we're gonna do this birch though and i'm gonna turn all of the birch into planks because that's pretty much all i need and then i think i need one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve stairs per module uh yeah it's 12 stairs per module and some other stuff let's get this coal though because i really really just want a decent fuel source and that's that's three pieces. That's not going to do me too well, but it's it's better than using trees, I guess. Ideally, I can find the ocean. I can get some... Oh, that looks like the ocean over there anyway. Uh, I don't think that's an ocean. I think that's just a big lake. But we'll get over there eventually. Uh, let's get these birch trees, like I said I would, and probably some saplings so we can farm them closer to home. Am I even picking these up? Oh, no, I'm out of inventory space. There we go. Sorry, flower. I don't really need you. Nothing personal, I swear. Um, what about the birch saplings? Let's get those. Did I get any birch saplings? I don't think I have birch saplings. Let's get rid of the oak saplings. See if there's any birch. Birch sapling? Yay. Yeah. Yeah. There's one. Can I get the... No, I need the birch. There we go. Okay, we've got one birch sapling. That's enough to start a farm over here. That way we're not running around all over the place. I say all over the place like it's actually going to be an issue. And we're just going to do it like this. And then you skip one, and you plant the rest of them. That way it gives us a nice little pathway in the middle. And we can just grow our prickly berries here. I kind of like that. Yeah, I like that a lot, actually. And then we're just going to continue building this area up while we terraform. Because terraforming is life. Okay, so let's go over here and grab some more walls. Our sugarcane is growing nicely, and that's because we're next to it constantly. So crops don't grow unless you're by them. I didn't know that a long time ago, I guess. And I would build farms all over the place anywhere I went just so I had food, not realizing that it didn't really matter because I wasn't by them. So the more you know, knowing is half the battle, kids. The other half is violence on the objective. 
And we're going into day 10. 90 days left after this. Going into day 10. We're going to make that stone wall around our prickly berry farm really quick. I don't think anything spawned. I think I went to bed fast enough. And we're going to get some cobblestone walls here. I don't think I should need more than like 18 of them. There we go. Now we're going to put these 18 around here and light it up just like we did the uh, other farm. There we go. So how many torches do I have? I've got six torches. I don't think that's going to be enough if I do one, two, three, four, five, and six. I need some more torches, which is fine because I have coal and I have four more, which should be enough for one, two, nope, three. And then we're just going to put our one in the middle here. Ooh. Ooh, this is a very dangerous walkway. One. And then you kind of take this and you build a little dirt pathway around it. Can't do that one, but you know. That needs grass to grow on it before we can do anything, but it kind of works. And I guess we could even put a fence down there just to replicate how it looks on the other one. Maybe? I don't know. Honestly, I don't think a sweet berry farm is that necessary. For being quite honest, I think this is probably a farm that's going to get destroyed really rapidly. I'm probably going to get rid of this farm relatively quickly. We're just going to put that torch there. This farm will soon be replaced by wheat once we get enough wheat. Uh, speaking of wheat, I don't have any seeds, so... Let's go to the house and we're going to finish the first module, which is the entryway, I suppose, for now. Get away, pig. Okay, so we have birch. We have a little bit of birch, not enough, because I would also like to replace all of this in here. Uh, let's build another crafting table. We need one in here. So we're going to build our crafting table. We're just going to throw it up here for now. And then we're going to come up here and we're going to do this. And that's going to give us four. And I think I said I needed 12. So we'll do that. And then we're going to do one and one and one, one, one. And then one, nope, give me that back. Let's put in some of our useless oak here. Not really useless, but it's just an aesthetic point at that juncture. And we're gonna take our birch and put it down here and we do that, 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 and then you do this. It's quite nice, quite nice indeed. Then we come over here and we do this. And then you have... Oh, I don't have enough spruce. Oh, that's fine. We'll finish that area with spruce later. Essentially, you just do this. Then you go one. And then that. Oh, no, that one shouldn't be there. So it should be... Like that. And then that one should not be there. Wait, should that one be there? Oh yeah, no, that's right. I just don't have the oak there. So then you just kind of hop up here, do that, and then do no. You do that. Then you do that. And then you come over here and you do that. And that is the first module. Uh, we only have like 22 of this left. I am going to move that chest. Where's that chest at? I need the chest. Oh, that's the wrong button. Give me chest. Nope. Nope. There we go. Got the chest in my inventory, so we can kind of put him over here for now at least. And then start storing things like flour, uh, wheat seeds we need, andesite cobble, sweet berries, all this stuff is going to go in there. There we go. Kind of clear out our inventory. Um, 
Let's go put the coal in the furnace. Let's keep the wood on me, keep the oak on me, keep the food on me, coal go in furnace. So let's go over to the furnace, put the coal in. Actually, we're just going to take the furnace inside. Not really a point in having it outside anymore. There we go. I'm going to throw the furnace up here for now and it'll keep me nice and warm while I sleep. There we go. And right there, and then we throw some coal in there, and we don't really need anything. Actually, we got raw mutton, so let's cook that. So we need some more spruce to finish this up. So let's go officially finish this area really quick. We're going to do all of the two. I only have 22 birch, so I just... Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen... 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. So I've only got 22, so we're just going to see how much I'll need. So 23, 24, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32. Oh, my axe broke. That's never good. Let's make some sticks out of these oak planks. And then give me some cobble, because I need another axe. Actually, I probably need two axes. Let's just go ahead and double that up. Double the variety up. I wish you could make something like a long axe, or like a more diddly axe, I suppose. That'd be nice. Okay. I know there's a bunch of weapon mods out there for Minecraft, but could you just, like, imagine getting one of those, like, bigger, just a nice, heavy swinging axe? And I did say I wanted to kind of open this up and bury the wall in a little bit more, I suppose. I mean, I guess it doesn't matter now, because it's kind of, like, buried up on this hill. Yeah, I don't think it actually matters now. So let's just put that spruce back. So we'll put you there, you there, and then this all becomes birch to give it a more dramatic look. I wouldn't say dramatic. I'd say more of a variety of color. It gives it a more... It stands out more. Uh, the oak is a little bit darker. It blends in with the other oak. So I don't really like it too much. Did I plant that birch tree? I don't remember. Oh look, our farm! It's doing quite well. Actually, let me eat. The person is hungry. Gotta get those nom noms in, right? Alright, let's hop over here. Where's that other pick? Or my other axe at? There we go. Another birch tree right here. I wish trees replanted themselves. It's like if you leave the seeds there, they kind of just... Maybe one out of every, like... I don't know, maybe just one of the seeds or saplings that falls has an option, if that makes sense, to uh, spawn a new tree, kind of. Or it falls and it plants itself, and then you have the option of deleting it or not. Something like that would be quite nice. I don't know. Just a thought. I know they're adding a lot of like updates to the game and everything, so as we go through these newer updates, it would be quite nice. We got 44 more birch... Um, let's go grab, should have thought about getting those freaking. okay, uh, did any saplings fall? I completely forgot. No saplings, but these, uh, wolves are doing a good job of keeping me stocked on wool. Quite nice indeed. And I think they attack skeletons too, so if I can tame these wolves and just kind of have them roaming the property... Because uh, eventually I am going to build a village here. The village is going to be where the spruce is right now. It's going to come out here. We're going to have a nice dock. There's going to be like a wooden pathway over the water. Or maybe like a decrepit bridge or something to that nether portal. It's going to look nice. I've got some good ideas for this place. I just have to survive long enough to do them. But I got a shield, and that's the first step, right? Shield, then Totem of Undying, after I get all iron armor. So let's finish with this area. 
And then I just need some half slabs. So, yep, birch. Get six half slabs here. And you just kind of step them. And then I'm going to take my door and put it right here. And then I'm going to take them birch planks and now I actually do need glass because I wanted to grab uh, I only need two I want to put a window right here I wonder should I do should I do that like that maybe have them step up like do a staircase right here maybe or maybe do these other three birch slabs I kind of like that, like that, all right. like that, like that, perfect. All right, we got our two glass. And section one is pretty much done. I know I didn't get any spruce, but it's getting too dark. Uh, do I have any spruce in here? I do not. But I have birch. Let me put a torch down because lighting is a must. And we must have constant lighting everywhere. And we're going to burn some of these and make some oak. Or some charcoal. And we're going to watch the sun set on day 10. And hardcore survival. And I've not died yet. Almost died earlier because of a stupid skeleton shot me in the foot. Next episode, do section 2. Finish section 1. Wait for our farm over there to start producing some actual food. And yeah, I think that is it. Thank you all for joining me, and as always, see you next time.